really did my best to come on here today not looking like a toe. That's the truth. <clears throat> Welcome back to the channel. Do you look like a toe? Do you look like a toe? If this is your first time watching the video, hi. If this is not your first time watching the video, you're insane. Welcome back to the channel, you guys. Today I am here to do a monthly favorites video. We are going to do monthly favorites videos every month, every month, every month. Kicking them out, kicking them out. I'm gonna do the best I can with what I got. Let's go ahead and get into this favorites video. It's, and really this is more than just like this past month. It's more like the past months or whatever. We're gonna talk about all of it. So we're gonna include a couple categories um, in this video to encompass all of these new wonderful things we're going to share. So my first category for monthly favorites is going to be to be music. You guys, if y'all are not listening to the new Dram album, Big Baby Dram, you're asleep. It's so good. It's so good. You need to be listening. Album. You need to be listening. It's so good. I literally shower to it every morning before I go to work. And then I play it again when I get home. And then I play it. In, I just, it's one of my favorite albums right now. So I, you need to do that. Second favorite thing music wise this month is my new tuner. Got it on Black Friday sale. If you play the guitar, bada bing, bada boom. And this made it to this video because I want to focus on favorites, but I really want to focus on things that have just made my life a little bit easier these past few months and this right here has made my life easier so i didn't do a what i got for christmas because i knew most of it was going to show up in this video anyway so it's fine um i asked my husband for this for christmas i wanted it so bad oh it's a sound link mini and i have been obsessed with this thing ever since i got it i thought i wanted a beats pill and i thought i wanted a jbl and then um, someone I know had one of these and I loved it. So I asked for it for Christmas. It's my baby. I'm really shocked I'm not hoarse in this video because of how loud I now take a shower. I love it. Everything else is beauty products. Um, oh no, there, I have some jewelry. I need. Okay, I did a jewelry haul a couple, uh, maybe like a month ago. And I unboxed some jewelry pieces, some Monet pieces. This is uh, one of the things I got from Missouri. It's very cute, but that's not why we're here. We're talking about favorites. Y'all, Monet is my new favorite jewelry company of all time. It's just my favorite. I I love them. I just love their jewelry so much. Monet is the bomb.com when it comes to beautifully crafted 24 karat jewelry. I just can't stay off the website i like i have to like this is crazy okay this is crazy um i have restacked my ears with the earrings and i'll leave the link in the description box if you're into jewelry jewelry is my top accessory i would say jewelry and bags are kind of like neck and neck well it depends on the time of year right now it's like jewelry then bag so i guess i could show a couple things okay First of all, get into the spiked hoop earrings. Y'all saw these in the unboxing. Unbelievably gorgeous. Also, these little band earrings. So gorgeous. Um, This chain, my jeweler made this, but the chain that came on, the chain that I'm wearing with it is from Monet. And then I'm not even gonna get into how much I love this bracelet. I got it for Christmas. I can't. I will, I, the whole video will be about this bracelet and how much I love it. So I just, I can't, I can't, I can't. Let's get into makeup. I've been trying to find my staples for my like minimal face. This is my right here. This is it right here. Okay. Minimal face, low key. Oh, I forgot. I had my bandages on my ears. I wasn't supposed to show y'all how much of a toe I am. I'm a toe. I don't have any earrings in my ear right now. My earlobe was repaired. They were stretched out from a phase in college. It's fine, it doesn't matter. And now I'm in bandages and cannot wear earrings at all in any of these holes for like some weeks or like two weeks or something. And then after they take the stitches out, I think I can wear earrings again, like a big toe. I hadn't looked like a toe since D-E-L-T-A. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Back to this makeup. So I wanna talk a little bit about my makeup favorites this these past couple months. This is the newest of the bunch. 
the YSL Lash Clash Mascara by YSL. It is so good. I will insert a small clip of me trying it on for the first time. Such a great mascara. I love mascara. I'm really getting into the pink lip gloss. I'm really into pink lip gloss on brown skin. It's my new obsession. It's crazy because I avoided pink lip glosses for some time. Um, not because I didn't think it looked good on brown skin because everything looks good on brown skin. I just didn't know what shade worked and the girls have been dropping the gems, okay? The one I'm wearing right now is a Sephora brand and uh, it's their glossed lip gloss line. And listen, this is in the color, hold on, Driven. Uh, Politics and Fashion talked about this on her YouTube page. I love Politics and Fashion. She's so pretty and so smart. It's so pink and pretty. And then another pinky little nude I've been liking, and I'm sure the girls are already all over it, the Fenty Gloss Balm Cream in Fenty Glow. Also very, very pretty. I wear this one a lot too. If I'm not wearing this, I'm wearing this. If I'm not wearing this, I'm wearing this. While we're on the subject of lips, let's talk about um, Summer Friday's Lip Butter Balm, the bomb.com. If you know, you know. If you use it already, sis that's what's up if you don't sis what's up this is in the color vanilla beige next is probably my favorite of the makeup items right now better than the pink gloss i don't know it is definitely up there and this is a cheek and lip tint cream this is new for me blush has always come in powder for me this is cream and i'm a groupie over it okay this is by the company Mad Hippie. Oh, it's dirty. Ew. Presentation, girl. There we go. Mad Hippie. It's in the color. Can you see? Plum. You guys. On my cheeks right now. On my cheeks every day. I don't care if I'm beating my face to the ground or if I'm like only wearing this and some mascara. I can't explain the impact of, I have had this on, just my cheeks, not even my lips, just my cheeks with some mascara. Go to work and people be like, your makeup looks really pretty today. And I put it on my finger. Do what you need to do. Next, we're going to talk about a new fragrance by Jo Malone. Now, I bought this in a purse size first. I have some larger Jo Malone fragrances, but I don't have this one. And the other ones that I have, I like them. I like them a lot. But it's not what made me go like crazy over Joe Malone. I was like, oh, that smells nice. Oh, that smells nice. When I got this sample size of this damn wood sage and sea salt, how long have y'all known? Y'all knew then, y'all. Wow, that's crazy. Mm. Spray it right now. Mmm. I want to smell like this every day. And I only have it in a purse size. So that means come Valentine's Day, I'm going to be knock, knock, knocking on Jeremy's door. I got to talk to y'all about these nail polishes. Listen, first of all, I know y'all been looking at this red on my nails. And you're thinking, oh my God, that's such a pretty red. And you know what, sis? You're right. It is a pretty red. Period. Look at that. This is the Venalisa Nail Gel, you guys. Seriously, the color on my nails right now is this one that is the color Garnet. I love these nail polishes. They come in these black bottles with the gold tops and bottoms and it's just the best gel polish I've ever used in my life. I don't know what else to say. Like I can't, I don't have the time to sit here and convince you. If you paint your own, if you do your own nails, go buy it right now. Ask me how much it is a bottle. Eight dollars, seven dollars and ninety-eight cent. Go get the gel polish. Damn. <laughs> as much as I am influenced by all the wonderful people I follow on YouTube, I am mostly influenced by my girls, like the girls I actually know in real life. Be hooking me up, okay? My good sis Chelsea introduced me to this Bio Elements skincare and I wanted to use it a solid like two three months before talking about it 
I started using this the beginning of October, October, November, December, and now it's the beginning of Yeah, three months. It just works. I don't know. This is the Bio Elements Moisture Positive Cleanser. I also have the Bio Elements Absolute Moisture, a lightweight moisturizer. Do what you gotta do. And lastly, and I saved it for last because it's the real done data. I'm talking about the real Bio Elements Recovery Serum. Get the serum. I want you to get the whole system. Get a wash, get the serum, and get the moisturizer. But if you want to start with one product of the three, get the serum. <laughs> get the serum. Ooh. The last part of this favorites video is really dedicated to a new way of life. And <laughs> I am no longer a body lotion girly. I know, I know, I know, I know. Hold your applause. Hold your applause. Okay, I have now joined the Body Butter Gang. I played around with Body Butters a while ago, maybe five, four or five years ago. Found a couple that I liked, just didn't stick with it. I don't know. I'm here. I'm here and I'm here willfully and I apologize that it took me so long. I'm in the Body Butter Gang, okay? Don't bring me no bottle of lotion. Don't bring me no bottle lotion. Bring me a body butter. The one that I am so obsessed with is the Brazil Nut Body Butter. I hate to even talk about this because it's seasonal at Trader Joe's, but it is the creamiest of body butters. It smells heavenly and it's $7. Uh, as you can see, it's, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. I'm not quite yet though. Don't get me wrong. It's I mean, we got a couple... You know, we got a couple days, but it's it's coming close to an end. And then we're going to swoop right in. <laughs> All the extra. Back to those who are close to you influencing you. This is another Chelsea buy. <laughs> Chelsea, run me some money. <laughs> so this is the body butter I'll be moving to next. Pop it up. And you refill it. And I didn't even know it did that when I bought it until I came home and was like, why do I only have a refill? <laughs> What's going on? And then after we're done with that one, or maybe some, maybe in between these two, we're going to jump straight in. And I also got the oil to go with this. So yes, it's a lifestyle change for me. Um, body butters, and I put an S on the end because I've now showed three. I don't have a favorite of the three right now. Just in general, body butters have been my favorite. I have really extended my skincare routine from my face to full body. I was taking really good care of my face, but I was just like, you know, putting on lotion when and where it's convenient. And that's no way to live. That is all my monthly favorites. That concludes my monthly favorites. Um, thank you guys for watching again. If this is your first time and you enjoyed it, go watch some other videos. I will see you humans in the next video. X's and O's, baby. <laughs>